Hey everybody, Dr. Adrian Cantu here with Ace Physio and Performance. Coming to you with vlog four, iliotibial band syndrome, or ITBS. Do you have pain in the outside of your knee? Have you ever been told you have iliotibial band syndrome? ITBS is the most common cause of chronic outer knee pain which is commonly seen in runners, cyclists, and rowers. It was believed that this issue was due to repeated knee bending and straightening. However, it is actually due to forces causing the knee to move inward, causing compression of deeper tissues in combination with constant knee bending and straightening. For example, walking with a narrow stance leads to the hips constantly crossing midline and the knee rotating inwards, which places increased stress on the IT band. Now it used to be believed that stretching and deep tissue massage were the best treatments for ITBS. However, recent research has found that stretching and massage of the IT band is actually worse for the issue and tends to make symptoms worse. A common exercise which should no longer be used is foam rolling of the IT band. Instead, the focus should be to modify how we move in order to decrease the increased stress on the IT band, as well as strengthen muscles which are weak. Now, muscles which are commonly weak with ITBS are the tensor fascia lata, the gluteus maximus, gluteus medius. Now what two of these three muscles have in common are they attached to the IT band. So it makes sense for these muscles to be addressed due to where they attach. The main thing is finding out why you are having the knee pain. Thank you for watching this video. If you found it informational, please give it a thumbs up, leave your comments below. And if you haven't done so already, please hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications so you don't miss videos in the future. Ace Physio and Performance, specializing in returning everyday athletes to their active lives without pain medication, injections, or surgery.